Today we'll be talking about microscopes. The main purpose of microscopes is to see details that are not visible with the naked eye. For example, compound light microscopes are used to see creatures that are not visible with the naked eye. In the compound light microscope, the light source lies under the specimen, so they are used to see transparent specimens. But in stereo microscopes, the light source lies in the top, so they are better at seeing opaque specimens. Stereo microscopes generally have a much lower max useful magnification than compound optical microscopes. Useful magnification is when magnification actually reveals more features. For example, the image on the right is much larger, but it has the same amount of details. The image on the left has a wider field of view, which means more of the sample can be seen at once. So, more magnification doesn't always mean a better image. The magnification of a microscope is determined by multiplying the magnification of the eyepiece by the magnification of the objective. For example, a 10 times magnification objective and a 10 times magnification eyepiece will result in a total magnification of 100 times. A compound microscope uses multiple lenses. It forms a magnified, inverted, and virtual image of a specimen. Did you like this video? Bye, see you next time.